It's, I'm be so controlling as a husband. <laughs> what? Because there's got to be some rules. Okay. Who gonna run the house? Ain't nobody finna. Ain't nobody finna Jada Pinkett Smith me. I promise you. <laughs> ain't no Man. nigga in my house. Ain't no what? Ain't no interview about me. Shit, I'm going back to prison. Grab back that neck. What you mean? <laughs> Hell no. <laughs> got me looking crazy out here. I can't. I can't. No, Jada Loki has been wilding lately. I don't rock with her. She didn't she write scares a whole me. Book. She's like a witch. I do not rock with her. What do, you, what do you feel like she did I that I think was so she's bad. encouraging some of these women to be evil and no disrespect to her. Uh, I like Willow Smith's music a lot. Mm-hmm. But I don't give a fuck if you don't fuck with me or what I say. Hey, that, that lady is a weirdo. She do shit and it, it brings like a new, like even if somebody's joking, sometimes them jokes be in real arguments. Like when that entanglement shit came out, mm-hmm. yeah, it was a joke. Mm-hmm. But you got to know some of us was really getting into it with our girls and they throwing out the new slang. And, yeah. Oh, yeah. What the hell? I'm the shit. Don't you ever know a fair? I was in a little entanglement. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> bitch, I'm damn serious. Bitch, I'm crying. I'll kill you. And then, bitch, you have one minute. Nah, you going through it. That was a word for like the whole year. They're like, yeah, we not dating. We just in an entanglement. And I'm like, what is that? Like, that's not a real that's situation. Si- like, just like situationship, you know? Right. Yeah. You ain't got to call it nothing, though. Like, I'd be looking for somebody to keep me on my vibe because when I'm super happy and in love, you're going to hear it in my music. When I'm hard, bro, you're going to hear it in my music. Keep me high. I get high off that. You hear me? Love feel good as a bitch. It I don't does. care who's going to break my heart. That's why I'm a lover girl. As as much as I don't feel like this generation has been capable of like being loyal and faithful, I'm still a lover girl. Like At the end of the day, I'm always going to find love everywhere. And I think that's your superpower as a woman or as a lover person is like you always gonna find that everywhere I'm gonna keep it real if people change their idea of what a relationship is it'll go easier what do you mean a by lot that? of people come into a relationship and they turn into a like I, I own you type of thing mm. I'm just trying to absorb this good energy about you you feel me and, and return the favor I shouldn't have to be like alright we at the point where you need to share your location that's real. I shouldn't have to be like, oh, yeah, I'm finna go in your phone. Why do I even need to think like you not allowed to talk to nobody? Do what you're doing. Don't burn me. Don't get pregnant. I ain't finna bring no babies. But this still 2024. I know this shit is way amped up. Mm-hmm, Nigga, mm-hmm. sex drive on a 10 right now mm-hmm. is different. Mm-hmm. I'm not trying to fucking hell no, because once the girls start doing that, the nigga do it back or vice versa. Yeah. Once one of them start going through the phone, he might don't even be no go through the phone ass nigga. But he's like, all right. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. The same energy that you give is what you receive. And you got to yeah. treat people like, you know, they're a partner. And I'm all for, you know, like giving people their space and their freedom. But I do, I, like you said, I believe in rules and regulations because when you're in a relationship, it's different. Like there has to be some level of understanding and mm-hmm. not control, but understanding of like, all right, this is what's allowed in our relationship versus what's not allowed. Like it's just, it has to be rules. Right. Just let them, not even rules, just like, these are the, my boundaries as a person, you know yeah. what I mean? Mm-hmm. I ain't even tripping, like, because rules make it feel like nigga, because me, I, if I hear the word rules, like, ain't nobody bossing me around, ain't no police in here, I'm out. It doesn't nigga. have to be worded as rules. But it's just like how people treat me, sometimes they be acting like a CO, like, I don't want no CO, I had a CO for five years, bitch, hell no. <laughs> No. Okay, so you the type that sets the tone then. No, no. It's just if we chill, right, and we never was talking at first, and somehow we start feeling each other, and now it's like, damn, it's really dope when we chill. Oh, crap. Then we fuck them like, damn, oh, there's no smell so well in here. Okay. Then, you know what I'm saying? You just, it's like go, you're going further. It's like, damn, it's dope. Leave it like that. Don't create an issue, bro. I was talking to a girl, and she just one day created an issue, said, whatever girls that I'm around that I rap with, that I'm probably fucking them. Oh, everybody told me I'm dumb. You fresh out, so you fucking everything. Fucking everything. Do you know how much new shit that came out while I was in jail? Yeah. About people I know doing the wrong thing. Girls, boys, they got new drugs. I used to be a druggie. Mm-hmm, I'm scared because mm-hmm. it all, no, hell no, no. Mm-hmm. I'm not just hitting the gang of people. Then I don't live in the projects no more. Mm-hmm. Everybody can't be knowing where I be at. I yeah. don't care if it's just a, a room because they going to know this is a room that I frequent. 